Okay, I'm about ready to call a wrap for the night. I've got everything put back together except for the um, output bearing here and the nuts to tighten it all down. I'll be working on that later. Uh, but I just want to do a brief description of exactly how I uh, put the rest of this together. There's a, a sleeve right here that fits underneath this gear. The sleeve and a needle bearing. I replaced it with a new one. That sleeve is a press fit and basically presses up against a synchro hub and uh, holds it in place. So what I did to get that on there, and it's a press fit, so what I ended up doing was getting it started, just lightly tapping it, just enough to get it started, not hard enough to do any damage to the bearings. Then I put a whole bunch of washers on this threaded part, and then I used the old nut, the old uh, countershaft nut, and basically, this is a left-hand thread, uh, tighten this up with the washers. So you see, I, I filled this space with washers, then I tightened this, and it kept moving the, the inner sleeve, which is, again, a press fit on this main shaft, up until it's firmly in price, pressed, pressed against this uh, synchro hub, holding it in place. After I did that, then I was able to go ahead and put on the new needle bearings and put the gear back in place. So that was a little trick there to use the threads to actually pull that up tight. This one here, to put this bearing on, uh, I did a sort of the same thing. I just used a little washer like this. It was it still allowed the out, it was pressing against the inner race, not the outer race, I could still spin the bearing. And I used the old nut, oh, sorry for the poor lighting, and just tighten that up, pulled that bearing onto place as well. So that bearing's installed. I need to put the nut here. Put the nut there. I need to put that nut on there. I need to put the a circlip, a bearing, a circlip. Uh, there's a ball here somewhere, right there. Uh, circlip, ball, speedo worm gear, circlip, and then we'll be done. I'm getting kind of tired though, so I'm going to call it a night. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.